Jacksonville Sheriff's Office confirming tonight a man appears to have shot and killed his wife before taking his own life. Police found the couple following a check on their well-being. Our Christina Burgess joins us live tonight from that crime scene. And Christina, I know you spoke with businesses and neighbors in the area. What did they tell you? Well, yeah, that's right. We were actually outside of the apartment earlier, but we were asked by police to kind of leave because it is a private property. But before leaving, we did see two JSO crime scene unit vans parked in front of an apartment with the door open. We had the chance to speak with neighbors and businesses in the area who tell us they were shocked after hearing about the news happening so close to home. I spoke with an employee at a European restaurant just a street over from where everything happened. That is I mean, yeah, that's the shocking news to hear. I mean, two lives are taken away and that's never fun. So that's not good. And I, I feel bad. I feel sorry for their loss. Yeah, and that employee also tells me that this neighborhood is filled with a diverse group of people. There's businesses, there's also schools here. So a crime of this magnitude is unheard of at this time. JSO is working with the medical examiner's office and also canvassing the neighborhood. Reporting on the south side, Christina Burgess, First Coast News on your side. And we will continue to closely follow this story on air and online. Find any updates on the First Coast News app and tonight on First Coast News at 6 and 11.